Hi guys, it is a gloomy, cloudy day here in the former paradise of South Austin, Texas. We have made it to Sunday morning, April 16th, 2017, which is, of course, Easter Sunday. Easter Sunday, I, I have to admit, I, I have never really understood what Easter is all about. Uh, I have some vague idea, I think... Today is when Jesus rose from the dead, rolled away the stone, and uh, ascended into heaven and sent down a big chocolate Easter bunny to uh, represent that fact. I anyway, so for my quote of the day... I finally have found someone to explain to me at age 57 um, what Easter is all about. And this fellow on the Young Turks, I have to admit I've never heard this guy, Brett Ehrlich. Brett Ehrlich, I guess one of these young uh, comedians that I've never known. And so at the risk of a copyright violation, I just got a copyright violation uh, from the ghost of Bill Hicks. So Brett and uh, Chank and the guys, uh, I hope you won't give me a copyright violation and a fair use thing. All I'm trying to do is, is spread the word of Brett and the Young Turks. So anyway, Brett, explain to us clueless morons what Easter is starting summing it up Easter's weird make sure I've got the volume all that okay Brett why is Easter weird Easter's weird. Here's everything you need to know about it from your moderately Hebrew friend who went to Catholic school. The 40 days leading up to Easter is called Lent. During this time, Christians honor Jesus' ultimate sacrifice of hanging on a cross till his chest cavity caved in. And to do that, they give up chocolate. Yes, I did have a cheat day, Alice. But I confessed, so the bad's gone now. The first day of Lent is Ash Wednesday. When you struggle to maintain eye contact with people who have giant ashen crosses painted on their heads, this is the hardest day to convince people people that Christianity isn't a cult. Like, I'm not saying it is or isn't. It's just when a man in purple chants a dead language and then paints a symbol on your face, it's hard to draw a dividing line between you and the faith militant. Shame! <laughs> shame, shame, shame. Yes, that's the, uh, the, the bottom line of Christianity. But, you know, once again, guys, I'm constantly making the point that I don't uh, you don't hear me making fun of these whack job Bible thumpers talking about that it is the end times that we're living in the end of days because that's exactly what we're doing. But anyway, I'm, uh, I'll put the link to the rest of this. Just a three minute video so you can hear Brett's explanation of why Easter is weird. And with that, I'm going to head out into the, uh, the yard before the rain moves in to bring you my doomsday sermon here on Easter morning. Bye, guys.